will have taken over a century for them to reach the point where we are now, where they are so close to implementing this new world order. And it will have taken over a century to subvert the United States of America in the manner that they have done. And I come back to this tagline of the Great Reset of the WEF. You know, you'll own nothing and you'll be happy. And I just want to say this is the absolute, first of all, as if, and this is the absolute antithesis of what the founding fathers um, sought out to achieve for future generations. It's completely diametrically opposed to what it means to be an American, to be the master of your own destiny. You couldn't be further. The U.S. Constitution and the agenda of the globalists implemented through these uh, vehicles like the WEF, like the UN, these international organizations, what they want, we know, we see it. We have the prime example, which is what is happening in the CCP's China, this mass surveillance state, these arbitrary lockdowns that are going on right now, which are so atrocious. They are using the pretext of, quote, this pandemic to install this biosecurity infrastructure. And uh, we will, the few freedoms that we are left are in the process of being completely taken away from us with this so called treaty, convention, agreement, international instrument, as they're calling it for now. We, we will see uh, once the draft is, is finalized, but it means that we, are, we won't have freedom of movement anymore. You know, we also have in conjunction with what they're doing with the um, CBDC, you know, the central bank digital currencies, everything will be digitized and every single thing will be tracked. And uh, this is not a world uh, in which uh, I, I want to live. And it's, uh, it's uh, something that we all have to, however we can, push back against and stop.